Hello YouTube, this is just another guy talking about stuff. I'm back with part three of my Artisanal Brew Works Warheads Extreme Sour Beer Review. A sentence which is a lot harder to say than it seems. This time around we're trying the black cherry flavor. Now if you watch the first two reviews, you'll know my biggest issue with these beers are they just aren't sour enough. So let's see how black cherry compares to lemon and watermelon. Got my glass, got the beer here. Let's hear that crack. Let's try and do a better job of pouring it this time. Have some patience. All right, it's an interesting red color, you'll see. A little bit darker than the watermelon, it seems. That's a little better job than the last two times, huh? So yeah, a little bit, a little bit darker than the watermelon. That makes sense. You really get that, that candy aroma that the other beers had. Definitely smells like a black cherry candy. That's that's a plus. Top this off a little bit. All right, let's jump right into it. Go back for a little bit more. Again, the same with the watermelon beer. This doesn't really have that strong flavor as opposed to the aroma of the beer. Like when you smell the beer, you can really smell that like black cherry candy-ish aroma, I guess. But tasting it just doesn't doesn't come across as much. So the flavor is a little little blandish, actually. Again, not very not super sour. Um, I mean, it is a sour beer. You can it's it is a sour. You can tell you tell that from different beers. Um, but when you think of it as Warhead's extreme sour candy, you get that puckered lip, and it's like you almost gotta fight back a little bit against it. Yeah, it's it's there, but it's just it's not anything you'd really like. When you think of a sour, you think, like, when you think of extreme, excuse me, when you think of the candy, you really think of, like, that sour, like, biting, like, fight back kind of food, and this just doesn't have that appeal to it. It's just, it's a sour beer, it's, you can tell the difference between a, a regular beer and, and this, as, as far as sours go, but you're just, it's missing something, it's missing that little bite, right, it's missing that little kick, um, I was really, really excited for these beers, to be honest with you. I, 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 like I said, I really, I did like the candy a lot. I like, I like that sour, that sour flavor. Um, <clears throat> but these, these, these beers just, just don't have that, that extra bite to it. Um, and this is probably my least favorite so far. Because the black cherry flavor doesn't really come across that much either, to be honest with you. Um, it, the, 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 it, the taste it tastes is there a little bit, but not not to not to the point where you want it to be. Like when you when you look at a can like this, and you see you see Wally Warhead, and it takes you back to that to those memories of the candy and how sour they were and the the taste. This just doesn't doesn't have that bite to it doesn't have that little extra kick to it that that I'm looking for um, and that's I guess my biggest disappointment with it um, like I said I really wanted to like these beers I, I, I thought it was a great idea um, I like like I said I like the warhead sour candy um, I like beer I like sour beers but this just just doesn't have it um, again it's it's not something I'm disgusted by I'm not I'm obviously gonna drink the whole thing I'm not not turning it down. I'm not not turning it away, but at the same time, I just I want a little something more. I want a little something extra, I guess, and it's just not giving it to me. I want to know if any of you have tried these beers. See what you think. Because um, for me, it's just I was expecting so much more. Yeah, this is definitely my least favorite of the of the flavors, 
And so far, I think the lemon, which I tried first, is actually still my favorite. Um, when I was trying the watermelon, the, the watermelon wasn't wasn't that bad. But thinking about it now, I think the lemon's probably my favorite, even though it kind of just tasted like a like a lemon shandy kind of. It was like a little bit of a sour taste to it, but again, not as much as I was expecting. So that's a little disappointing. Again, the, a positive about these beers, I will say they. They go down very smooth. They're very easy to drink. Be a good summertime beer. Maybe maybe this isn't the right time of the year for it. <clears throat> Can you look at that color and you you think you're gonna get something maybe a little bit sweeter, a um, little bit more uh, more flavor heavy, you know. Tastes like the uh, tastes like the candy almost. It just it just isn't there. I think I have less to even say about this one than I did the other two. Um, that black cherry flavor really isn't coming across like I expect it to. It's not it's not as sweet as I as I thought it would be. It's a um, or as sour as I thought it would be to be honest. So. So what am I getting out of this? Yeah, I don't know what it is about this one. It's just, it's it's not sitting with me very well. It's, it's not terrible. Um, but it's not, it's not great. Honestly, I'd barely say it's good. And I do feel bad saying that. Like, the people at Artisanal Brew Works, I'm sure, work very hard on this beer. Um... Again, it's a great idea. I, I love the marketing behind it. I love the idea behind it. But the beer itself just isn't isn't hitting for me. You know, it isn't 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 working for me. It's definitely better sour beers on the market. I'm sure you can I'm sure you can find better ones. If you have any to recommend, please leave them in the comments. I always like to hear what you guys think. Again, I guess the best part about these is they, they do go down pretty smooth. They're pretty easy to drink. Um, of course, maybe if they're a little more sour, they wouldn't be as quick to drink. But that's that's what you get, I guess. Maybe that's maybe that's part of the idea behind it. Yeah, this one is definitely my least favorite of the of the group. We got one more to go. That'll be the blue raspberry. I expected blue raspberry to be my favorite, so we'll see how that goes. Cheers. And we're finished. So thanks for watching. As always, please like, subscribe, comment, YouTube stuff. Click a bell. If I'm missing anything, let me know. Until next time, Witty, sign off, catchphrase.